Folks, a short video here to talk about our pals, Beneficial Bacteria. Now, there are a lot of products out on the marketplace, and sometimes it's hard to make sense of them all. Some of you may be familiar with the content in this video, but for those who aren't, a little on our pals, Beneficial Bacteria. Are you using the right type at the right time? Coming up. Now, a month ago, I was down at my local fish store, Pasadena Tropical Fish, searching for a bottle of API Stress Zyme for a buddy of mine who was setting up his very first tank. Now, as he was running around the store, taking video of all the fish, I confidently went to get him a bottle of API Stress Zyme. After all, I knew he would have to cycle his new tank, and I had been using API Stress Zyme for years. Loved the product. I use it for general tank maintenance, and on the back of the bottle, it says it contains millions of live bacteria. Has to be good stuff. After I grabbed the bottle and told the owner of the store, Steve, what I was using it for, he politely reminded me that yes, while API Stress Zyme does contain bacteria, it is mostly bacteria adept at consuming sludge, the cocktail of dead algae, fish waste, and uneaten food that collects in the gravel bed. Huh? Now I'm confused. For years, I thought Stress Zyme was great for cycling a tank, but it does not include nitrifying bacteria. Now what is nitrifying bacteria? It is the AOB, or ammonia oxidizing bacteria, that converts our ammonia into nitrites, and the NOB, or the nitrite oxidizing bacteria, that converts our nitrites into nitrates. Here's an old test from my 10 gallon tank, and you can see it was starting to cycle. But there are millions of species of bacteria out there, so it makes sense that there are a lot of products out in the marketplace for the different needs of our aquariums. Now in this video, we're gonna talk about two, nitrifying bacteria and sludge eating or cleaning bacteria and the products you can find those in. Let's talk about our nitrifying bacteria. Our pals, nitrifying bacteria are the all-stars. This is the bacteria used to cycle our tank and the bacteria that eats ammonia and nitrites. Products such as API Quick Start, Seachem Stability, and Fluval Bio Enhancer all contain the same type of bacteria nitrifying bacteria. These products include our AOBs, ammonia oxidizing bacteria, such as nitrosomonas and nitrosococcus bacteria. And these products contain our NOBs, our nitrite oxidizing bacteria, such as nitrobacter bacteria. Our sludge eating bacteria. This is bacteria that eats decomposing organic material that collects on the bottom of our tanks. Products such as API Stress Zyme, Seachem Stress Guard, Fluval Biological Cleaner, all do the same thing. These have our sludge eaters. Bacteria that eat decomposing material, the cocktail of dead algae, fish waste, and uneaten food, and they help our nitrifying bacteria. Sludge in your aquarium robs nitrifying bacteria of oxygen. So these guys help nitrifying bacteria breathe. So how do we make sense of all these products? Well, if you are cycling your tank or if you do a water change and wanna add those good bacteria that eat ammonia and nitrites, we wanna use products such as API Quick Start, Seachem Stability, Fluval Bio Enhancer, or from the good folks at Continuum, Bacter Gen F. For general tank maintenance or if we have a buildup of sludge in our tanks, if we want to help our nitrifying bacteria breathe, we want to use products such as API Stress Zyme, Seachem Stress Guard, Fluval Bio Cleaner, or from the good folks at Continuum again, Bacter Gen F, which contains nitrifying and sludge eating bacteria. So, folks, I hope that is helpful. The Den is now on Instagram at DMichael's Fish Den. Join me if you are so inclined. Please like, comment, subscribe for future content. And as always, thanks for watching.